you this morning from um, Isaiah chapter 12. All right. Now these are, are not new things to you, but they are new things because they're new every day. Amen. And in that day you will say, O Lord, I will praise you. Though you were angry with me, your anger is turned away and you comfort me. Behold, God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. For Yah, the Lord, is my strength and my song. He also has become my salvation. Therefore, with joy, you shall draw water from the wells of salvation. In that day, you will say, praise the Lord. Call upon his name. Declare his deeds among the peoples. Make mention that his name is exalted. Sing to the Lord, for he has done great, excellent things. This is known in all the earth. Cry out. Shout, O habitants of Zion, and great is the Holy One of Israel in your midst. Yeah, Come together today on the Lord's Day yeah. to do this. Yeah, Amen. This week, each of you have drawn from the wells of salvation. Yeah. Yeah. That well is not a well that can be covered up by men. Amen. That well has a source that comes from the throne of God and the Lamb. Amen. That well, you have tasted of. Yes. And you've said it is sweet. You've said it is good. And so we've come together to share with one another of the water that we have drawn with joy from the wells of salvation. Amen. Today, we will call upon His name. Yes. And He will hear us. Amen. And He will answer. Today, we will declare his deeds among the people, among his people who are here and at the opportune time amongst people who are not his people, that they may hear. Amen. Today, we will declare that his name is exalted. Amen. Today, we will cry out and shout, for great is the Holy One of Israel in our midst. Amen. Now, before we pray, I want to make slight mention of this. The president declared that this is a national day of prayer. I'm happy for that. But every day is a kingdom day of prayer for us. Brother Bob is going to come and he is going to have a lesson for us on the subject of Paul's prayers. I look forward to that. Let's pray for him as we begin. Our Father, we've come together with great expectation, great anticipation of hearing good things, of realizing in our mind things that are to come, even things that are right now present. I pray, Father, that through your word we will be strengthened in our inner man, that we will encourage one another, that we will press on towards the goal, towards the high mark of God in Christ and in God. I pray, Father, that you would bless us. Father, help us that our hearts might be tuned to you, that we might be a blessing in return to you. For through Jesus we pray. Amen. 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 Thank you, brother.